listening to me. Sure, I'm listening, but it's still an honor code violation. But I meant to sign the pledge, I just... forgot. Didn't you hear the song? Don't forget to sign the pledge. You forgot to sign off, so it's off to the slammer. I demand a phone call. I demand a lawyer. I can't believe you just left me here in jail. Relax. He didn't leave you in jail. He didn't? No. Read your arrest warrant. <laughs> Go directly to... Yale? Sauce! This is Yale? Sauce! We are poor little lambs who have lost our way. It can't be. You don't believe it? Read the lock. But it's like a prison. Bah, bah, bah. I've got to get out of here. I've got to escape. Even if you do escape, you probably won't make it back to Princeton. Are you telling me I have to stay in Yale? Stop! Forever? Exactly. <laughs> I've really got to get moving. Okay, no phone. A letter. I can write a letter to my girlfriend at Princeton. Ooh, yes. Let's write a letter. We're very good at writing letters. <laughs> We're all English majors. <laughs> I should have guessed. Dear Bambi. Right. Wait, what? You can't begin like that. <laughs> this girl is someone special, right? Right? Well, dear Bambi is simply mired in the banal. You have to go with something moving. Words whose power grips the reader right from the very beginning. My beloved Bambi. Uh, most beloved Bambi. Most longed for Bambi. Yes, 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 yes right right that that down, that's good. good. Most longed for Bambi. I'm in trouble. Oh, no, no, no. You're not just in trouble. The entire fabric of your existence is unraveling around you, leaving you cold, naked and exposed to the world's wintry winds! The time's terrible turmoils. It's atrocious atrocities. <gasps> Redundancy! <laughs> now, where were we? Please come at one wait. I have a theory. Literary theory. trouble with this letter? Because you won't let me set pen to paper? Oh, don't be silly. Your communication is hindered not by your inability to express your desire, but by the inability of the words themselves to express your desire. Deconstruct! Deconstruct! Can't you see? This is not a letter about escape. This is a letter about language itself. Semantics. Why even try to communicate? Your words inevitably come back to you in a self-reflexive backlash that stuns you, not with its power, but with its impotence. Powerless language. Postmodernism. Alienation. Cultural anarchy. Don't waste your ink. What can you write? when James Joyce has already written it all. <laughs> <laughs> oh my God, we're out of the moose. <laughs>